In Venezuela, the Secretary of the Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries, OPEC, started Monday a work agenda to consolidate relations and the future of oil markets. OPEC Secretary General Haitham al Qais met with the Venezuelan Minister of the People's Power for Oil, Jesus Rodriguez, at the headquarters in Caracas of the state-owned oil company PDVSA. The meeting seeks to strengthen policies and strategies for the benefit of the oil-producing countries in the world's oil market and to expand cooperation alliances with this important multilateral organization. OPEC Secretary General Haitham al Qais sentenced that the world growth will demand much more quantities of energy from all sources. At OPEC, we launched two weeks ago our World Oil Outlook, which is a research document that we do every year. This time we are extending the period until 2050, where we launched our vision for the world on the growth of primary energy demand. So for oil, with the growth of the world economy, which we see is going to double in size compared to today, until 2050, with the growth of world population, which is going to increase from 8 billion to 9.7 billion 2050. And also two very fundamental elements, energy poverty in some parts of the world. Today we have almost 700 million people who don't have access to electricity, we have urbanization. Urbanization is very important since we have almost 60 million people that we are going to mobilize to create nine cities in the world until 2030, then. All these are the most important factors leading us to the conclusion that the world will need much more energy, all energy sources, not only oil, also gas, solar, eolic, all forms of energy are going to be important for the future, for the growth of the world. Solar, vento, todas las formas de energía que van a ser importantes para el futuro.